Hello everyone, and welcome back to RPG World. Uh, today we're testing Republic of Pirates. It's uh, another demo that uh, it's on the next fest festival. Uh, the game have a demo on Steam available for everyone, so you can play it for free. This version of the game. Uh, they plan to be. The, they have a planned release on 19 June. So in one week from now, when we recording this uh, this gameplay. So let's have a look. By the way, guys, like, subscribe if you enjoy the content. I really appreciate if you can drop a subscribe to the channel. It will help a lot. It's a brand new small channel and uh, will be really helpful. Let's get started. Our settings, everything on ultra. Let's turn a little bit of volume down. Okay. A uh, campaign. We don't have another option. Oh. Dublons. Difficulty. Let's play on me medium. Greed. It tears us all down eventually. Heck, that's what this is all about. We rob, we plunder, we kill. All for a bit more wealth and another day of freedom. But we all know the truth. There's only one way out of this pirate life. And if it's not at the end of a rope, it's usually a shot in the back from a pistol of a crewmate. The Republic of Pirates was meant to be different. But the greed got to them too. Turning on one another like that. Damn shame what they did to your old man. And now they're carving up the archipelago between the three of their crews. Lucky Jack Howell and the self-proclaimed raiders of the Caribbean. Scar and his gallows men. And Matilda Barbero, leader of Los Guerreros. Los Guerreros. Spanish gold by the galleon and a nice slice of the Caribbean to call home. They couldn't play nice, could they? Well, if it's revenge you want, I'm with you. I owe your old man that much. We're one ship against three fleets, but they aren't expecting us. We'll make for the archipelago and set up on an isolated island before they get wind of our intentions. Revenge for your father and the chance to build something better. Okay. Let's do that. This is the archipelago, all right. But it's far too dangerous to continue out in the open. Let's stick to the shallows for now. A sail. What is here? Okay. I like that. What's that? What the hell was that? My 
Oh, cool. oh, it's a quest. Run, run, forest. <laughs> Boom! Oh, 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 oh. What's a trap? That was a close call. The archipelago's in chaos after the collapse of the Republic. We'd better hunker down on Galley Island for now. Come up with a plan. Let's start with a dock to house our supplies. Let's start with... Let's start with that. Select the building category from the toolbar at the bottom of the screen, okay. Remember me about. If we want to take the fight to our old companions. We'll need men. There are plenty of rough and ready types looking for work, so long as we give them somewhere to stay and something to do. Remember me a lot of Anna about Anna. Uh, can I see the map? The whole map? Okay, we have the one marketplace uh, will close to Hans, okay. Have an area of effect, the marketplace. Through the debris from the sunken sh ships. Ah. Building effect range, yeah. Such a brothel and tavern fulfill the wants of workers in the surrounding area. Okay. The range of the effect is indicated by the coloration of nearby roads when placing or selecting the building. But what about if you don't have roads around? Hmm. Maybe I, I want to build the roads after I will place the building. Unlocked. Amazing. Ok. 
give me that resources. You cannot modify basically to to place the building on another place. No. That's the maximum zoom that we have. It's good. Looks nice. Decoration. Uh, I don't think matter too much where uh, we play this. Salvaging materials from wrecks is good and all, but we've got plenty of resources at our fingertips on the island too. We'll need a steady supply of wood for what's to come. Yes, I'm sure about that. There's a lot of wood in this island. Should set a couple of the lads to moving goods from place to place. It's more efficient to dump materials at a depot so they don't have to carry them so far. Okay. Insufficient. Oh, no depot area. Okay. The more we provide for our workers, the happier they'll be. The happier they are, the more they'll contribute. Cutthroat Very pirate similar with too. Arno. He needs fish, marketplace and rope. We can upgrade the buildings, that's good. Uh, tactical map, diplomacy, notification.
We spotted some floating barrels not far from the coast. It might be nothing. They have fish now. Uh, I wonder if we'll be in range of the depot. I don't think. Yeah, they will move automatically from uh, from the loge to sawmill. See if they have fish. Ah, they have. It's okay. I think it will be okay. I think the dog uh, replace a depot basically. Exploration. A treasure in barrel pounds. Oh. Well, the barrels were empty, except for a bunch of letters from the British West Indies Company about claiming some island or another. Nothing that mentions treasure. What's up? Mary Connor. Here's someone you want on your side in a fight. She's a tough old gal, and hold her own in a naval battle or a tavern brawl just the same. The men all look up to her. She was once at Jack's right hand. He must have done something really stupid to piss her off. Besides knocking off your old man, that is. If we're going toe to toe with the former Republic, we could do with her directing our ships and not theirs. John, is that you? Thank God I found you here. Jack double-crossed me. Well, I was trying to betray him first and he found out, so... Anyway, the fair lady's in a pretty bad state. Help us out, won't you? Uh... More battle. By the way guys, the secret word for the Discord giveaway is pirate, okay? And team with the, the game, so the pirate it's, uh, is a secret word. Uh, can I repair? I think I need repair. Too far from dock, okay. Captain, 
The men reported several ships heading directly for us. Looks like we've been discovered. Let's put the fair lady's firepower to some use. Oh. Use a tactical map. Lol, look at that. Action, British, British West in this company, French company, Royal Barcelona, three traders, traders of the Caribbean. This will be the whole map, and it's this. What the heck? Can't do that. Thank you, Captain. I think the lads and I are in a capable pair of hands with you. We'll be staying a mite longer if you don't mind. How about a drink to celebrate living one more day, eh? Oh, of course. Well, but I have one more ship. Oh, yeah. Oh, basically I defended only with, uh, with a fair lady. I didn't use Wanderlust. We have fish. The room. And brother. Rope is the most important. Uh, wait a sec. Uh, hand plantation and rope maker. Okay. Sol deposit. Let's increase the road. Oh. Plantation fields, how to... Sugar plantation... Uh... How to make the fields? Hmm. Okay.
Okay. And this what need? Man, we need more workers, I think. Insufficient amount of material in storage. Why? I need to wait for them to... Isabella Rojas. Cunning, pragmatic, seductive. Everything a good madam needs to be. She worked under Jack for a long time, but he never could see past her soft skin and appreciate the tact and charm underneath. I'm glad she gave that lecherous prick a taste of his own medicine. The brothel girls trust Isabella with their lives, and she does everything in her power to make them comfortable. I think she'll be invaluable to our cause. Just try not to fall for that alluring look in her eyes, you hear? <laughs> Captain, I'm happy to make your acquaintance. My name is Isabella, and I have a proposition which might be of interest to you. Okay, let's I hear. I need a little distraction, wouldn't you say? What do you have in mind? I have no idea. Man, what they don't have here? Can I upgrade the depot?
What do you want? is open for one day. One day. One. And the girl is dead. I will not stand for this. You either kill the prick who did it and make an example of him or provide protection for the rest of the girls. Oh, man. Decisions. That's great. Brother upkeep will increase. We'll need to build a new decoration. I will build a new decoration. Let me build a few more houses. I need to upgrade the houses. Okay, this is what I wanted. That's a lot. I have now 84 I, and I can have maximum 120 from the houses that I have I need uh, 200 for the quest I need a lot more houses by the way Are you kidding me? I think I need more uh, ham plantation.
working at maximum capacity. Okay, now the problem is only the workers. I need the... Uh, 170, I still need 30. I need, I need to build three more houses. Yeah. Uh, can I explore this time? Oh, yeah. I don't think I can go too far, uh, it's limited now. way to go <laughs> available labor stand uh, don't have jobs you know what I think I will make one more uh, ham plantation honestly
Okay, I don't think it will be a problem anymore, the hemp now, honestly. Plantations. Need one more. I think I need one more depot soon. Come on, one more worker. Are you fucking kidding me? Cannot recruit one more? Uh, let me build one more fishery, you know? Now for sure will come. I have one more house. I did it. Jack knows where I am and is coming for me. I won't run away again. Let's prepare for his arrival. How? Defensive towers? Man, uh, will matter where we put the towers? Can we put the towers on the other side of the map now? The Iceland? Uh, 
I don't think it'll be Looking connected with Jack the road. Howell. What a cowardly shit of a man. If treachery and deceit wore skin, it would look like this prick. Never one to enter a fight with the odds stacked against him. He prefers to meddle from a safe distance. Jack doesn't look you in the eye when he pulls the trigger. He gets someone else to do it. Usually a friend. Even with all the crews he's double-crossed or swindled, he's somehow avoided waking up with a dagger in his eye. That's why they call him Lucky. That luck has to run out sooner or later. Okay, boys. Okay, I, I cannot... I cannot do anything. It's scripted. Well, well, don't you look familiar. I'm sorry for what happened to your father. Awful accident, that. Don't let it put any silly ideas like revenge in your head. This archipelago is ours. Make any trouble, and something might just happen to you, too. So, there's no avoiding it. Jack knows we're here. The way I see it, we either pack up and leave, or we pick up the pieces, repair our fleet, and take the fight to the bastards that wronged us twice. Oh. What's it gonna be, Captain? And now, basically, the campaign is done, and I think you have the option to continue here or to... No. Ah, I can continue here. 200 lab uh, workers and to build a ship. Man, but wait a second. Uh, the level up. That's on. Seal clothes ham uh yeah before seal maker I need a cloth cotton plantation for sure. Shipyard Captain Ian Need cotton first.
Insufficient workforce, amazing. I solved the problem with uh, with the materials for shipping for ships. Now what I need, I need the shipyard. Are you kidding me? Insufficient materials, man. I need more wood. I need more fucking wood. We can plant more trees. workers are you kidding me why oh I still need wood a lot of wood Need to wait. I need a lot of wood, man. But I just built another uh, wood cutter. Man, but I still don't have man. Upgrading houses, that's what I need. But the problem is uh, when I upgrade the houses, they will increase the demands.
Oh, look at that. They need meat, they need clothes, they need candles. Reason. Hammocks, tavern. Need to unlock. I don't have any ship anymore to explore on the. Oh, fuck. Fifteen. Okay, wait for two more wood. I want to see what is that. I can build that. Any captain worth their salt will be at the captain's inn. Feel free to pick the captain you like the look of. Just remember, you can't have them all. Hire a captain at the captain's inn. Wait, no road access? How? This is the fucking road. Okay. And then all the Calderon. And all of them have different skills. to upgrade five. No more wood again. Oh, still need to build uh, the shipyard. Need 20 wood. What? What's wrong? Not upgrade the dog. Too much fish. Pull the fish. I think that I need to upgrade one more. One, two, three, four. Uh. 
Yeah. And now... I didn't unlock the next tier, man. We need to build a ship. We need to wait for the wood to build the shipyard. 20 wood. Okay, downgrade, aha. Uh -huh. I like the music. Uh, one more depot, I think, is needed. Building ships. Yeah, I need to build a ship, assign a captain. Nice. Only this one is available, I think. Oh no. Wow. Smoke bomb. Cannons, man. How the hell to build cannon? Improve sales. Uh, the captain that I have, it's have the bonus at the Kog. Where is the... Where are the captains that I have? Okay, captains and, and in the inn. Total captains. How can see the captains? I don't see the one that I can recruit. I want to see the one that already recruited.
I don't know. All Iceland, we can have more Iceland. Here, new captains have arrived. That's weird, you know? You can see only the new captain that you can recruit, but you don't see the one that you recruited. Anyway. You can see it here. We started to build a ship. Amazing. Oh, it's quick. Anyway, guys, we stop here. We made an idea about uh, the, the game. This is just a testing video, yeah? It's not a playthrough. Only to see how the game feel. The first impression, the genuine first impression about the game. And the first impression is very solid. Uh, very, very Anno vibes. I played a lot of Anno, by the way, in the past. And uh, yeah, I have all the classic mechanics that one city building in medieval era need to have. All the buildings, the normal buildings that need to be here. Of course, with a lot more pirate uh, themes, pirate vibes. It's, uh, it's nice. I really like it. I enjoy it. Yeah, very more than playable, polished, didn't get any bug, lag, etc, etc. I'm very curious how it will be uh, later, you know, uh, when you discover more Icelands, about the trade diplomacy, I so you can have uh, the trade system, I'm very curious, the, the diplomacy system, I'm very curious, the combat at high level with higher level ships will be interesting anyway a game to keep your eyes on here i will add the game on my wish list it's very chilling relaxing to play from time to time a game like this honestly me one myself i really enjoy from time to time to play games like this it's chilling you know we can pause the game you can go to take something, do something else, and then you can come back to continue your, your playthrough. Save, continue in three days, one week, anytime. It's, uh, it's nice, it's good. And this one is very solid. I will add it on my wish list, and we keep the eyes open on uh, the development, the full release. Please, guys, I really appreciate if you like, subscribe to the channel. If you enjoy the content, we have a lot of small indie games that we we tried on the channel. More than 100 already in a few months. You can search on the channel for the playlist, for videos, if you are curious about more gameplay. Thanks for watching. Like I said, comment below, by the way, what you think about the game, what's your opinion about the game. You can, any discussion it's open, you know, opinions, uh, different opinions matter, even for me or for others that check the, the video. Okay, thanks again, like, subscribe if you enjoy the content, and see you next time, bye!